Hi friends, in this video I am going to tell you how to install python for windows and to do this we need to follow a few steps. The first step being we need to determine the system architecture and uh, I have seen a lot of guys uh, having difficulties in determining the system architecture and uh, they always are confused in uh, which architecture they are running on whether it's 32-bit uh, or uh, whether it's 64-bit so I'm gonna tell you how to determine the system architecture first then you need to download the python interpreter from this website www.python.org and uh, thereafter installing python is just a piece of cake you need to just click on next next and uh, that's it so let's just see how you can determine the system architecture so if you are running on windows you need to go into your command shell or command prompt you can access command prompt by typing cmd in run s so you just need to tap press you need to press start plus r type in cmd and it will open a ca command prompt like this you are seeing in this screen and then type in system info this command system info into the command prompt and uh, you'll see your system type as something like this x86 so if you see the output which is x86 that means you are operating on a 32 bit machine and uh, if you are seeing so if you see something like this x64 ya fir x86 underscore 64 then you are running on a 62 bit machine this is actually it's a 64 bit sorry so you are running on a 64 bit machine if your architecture is something like this or this so so the very first step was to determine the system architecture next step is downloading python from its official website so if you go to the official website of python you will see a web page if you go on to download section and uh, if you download the python 2.7 then you will have uh, this kind of page in front of you these are all the different installers for uh, different uh, operating systems if you are uh, operating on windows you need to download either this or this installer from this uh, particular page so if you are on 32 bit machine you need to install this python x86 msi installer and uh, if you are operating on a 64 bit machine you need to install this x86 64 msi installer so once you click on it you'll your download will start then you need to open up the file which you downloaded just click on it and uh, you'll have a setup prompt so all you need to do is just click on the setup file and then next 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 and next and that's it python will be installed on your windows one more thing the latest version of python is 3.x but we are proceeding with python 2.7.14 and this is because python 2.7 is most popular and uh, the reason behind it is uh, there are a lot of libraries and modules third party modules especially which are compatible with python 2.7 but uh, are not compatible with python 3.x and unfortunately we do not have any alternative of them as well so that's why 
proceeding with python 2.7 is a good choice and uh, you can also download python 3.x and that will be also fine there are a bit of changes bit of minor differences between these two versions for uh, those who are learning basics of python you won't encounter a much difference so if you decide to go with python 3.x then it is also fine whenever there is a function or there is something different which uh, i will teach you or tell you then i'll exclusively mention that this is for python 2.7 and this is so that's it for this video see you in the next video